This video microtopic demonstrates a method for sizing down a platinum cobalt ring containing channel set princess cut stones down each side of the ring's shank. After cleaning the ring, inspect the ring and stones for damage and debris. Check the ring with a magnet to determine the alloy. It's magnetic, so it's a platinum cobalt alloy. All other platinum alloys are not magnetic unless they contain cobalt. The ring needs to be sized down a half size from 5 and 3 quarters to 5 and a quarter. Scribe 1.25 millimeters to be removed from the shank. This will make the ring size smaller than a size 5 and a quarter, but it will allow for rounding after the shank has been reconnected. Saw and remove the piece from the shank. Close the opening in the shank with half round flat nose combination pliers. Do not place the pliers over the stones set in the shank or you could break them. Platinum's lack of metal memory is a benefit for this process. File chamfers in both ends of the shank. Without chamfering, the laser cannot penetrate deep enough to bond the core of the joint. Notice that the ring is not round. It will be rounded after it has been welded. Direct the laser around all sides of the joint to weld the metal through to the center. Then laser fill the joint using 28 gauge platinum cobalt laser welding wire. Overfill the joint so you can file and smooth it without reducing the original dimensions of the shank. File inside the ring and round it on a mandrel. Do not hammer over the stones. The finished size is slightly larger than a 5. Inspect the ring for cracks or pits in the sizing joint. Then check for loose stones. After blending the joint, buffing and polishing, the ring is ready to deliver to your customer. The dimensions of the shank haven't changed and the joint is the same color as the rest of the shank.